Quem nos pôs assim A vida escala Quem te me levou roubou minha alma Mas de ti não sabe nada Bernardo Pereira, we read blogs.com. We are here with Felipa Azevedo, Eurovision 2010 with the song Adias Asi. Take us back to 2010 and tell us more about your incredible experience in Oslo. Um, it was wonderful. Um, it was um, one of the experiences of, uh, of my life. And, um, and I, I miss that time. Were you sad you weren't able to sing the song in English or was it was the original plan to sing it in Portuguese from the very beginning? Uh, no, uh, only in Portuguese because um, uh, RTP uh, always want uh, the Portuguese uh, language and uh, I think that's right because uh, if I'm Portuguese I sing in, in Portuguese, why not? So you were the last Portuguese act to qualify for a final at, at Eurovision back in 2010. After that, Portugal missed the competition two years, in 2013 and 2016, and they already announced that they're coming back in 2017. What are your thoughts on them keeping Festival da Canção as the selection method for Eurovision? Um, I don't know uh, how, uh, what to think about that, but mm, in my opinion, uh, I like the show because uh, it's a thing that they do like for a long years. Um, but probably they could um, choose a, a singer as well and uh, send a internally song. select a specific singer and a specific song. Why not? <laughs> After Eurovision, you've you've been away from the spotlight. You went on to be a shopkeeper, if I'm correct. Yeah. And then you came back and made a comeback at The Voice. Were you invited to, to be on the process in The Voice or you personally applied to be on The Voice? I cannot answer that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a secret. It's talent, baby. She's there because she's talented. <laughs> but um, you went through the blind auditions and then the second round and finally you went on the live shows and you sang Adele. Were you expecting to, to be eliminated in such an early stage? Um, I, I wasn't expecting to be el eliminated um, at the first um, live show, probably, I don't know, in the second because um, we all knew that uh, Diolinda will win because uh, of her talent. Um, but that uh, was okay for me, that was okay. For me. And after that, you, you came back to the music industry here in Portugal. You currently um, released, uh, your, the, your latest single uh, was released by Darko, the band, and you were featured in, in the video and the song it's called um, September, September Issues. Issues. Exactly, we did an article on Weebly Blogs about September Issues. Um, it's a completely different Philippa we're seeing, a more dark Philippa, a more intense Philippa. Are you trying to stay away from the perfect image of a Disney princess everyone put it on you when you were at Eurovision? Of course, because um, we all grew up. <laughs> I'm not saying uh, um, a little girl for uh, forever and um, I, I don't have problems to be a, a, a a Disney girl because I didn't knew that I was mm. that or people think about that of myself but um, I'm a woman now I'm not um, I'm not a little girl anymore so, so this is just the process of growing up yeah. as an artist and the person as and well. the person as well of course and it's it's an interesting choice you've been pairing up with you pairing up with with Darko because they 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 they're bandits starting now, and they're they're releasing ex extremely good good singles. Or their singles are great, and were they the ones that approached you 
to be featured in their video? Or did you, or were you like, oh my God, they are so good, I need, I need to work with them? Um, no, um, me and Ze, um, Ze is the vocalist, Zay is the vocalist from Darko, for, for those of you who don't know. <laughs> Um, have a beautiful uh, friendship uh, relationship. So, um, and uh, they uh, uh, a long time ago, he, he said, "I need to sing with you." And um, and I said, "Of course." Now uh, he was like, "This song uh, was not to be uh, supposed to be in the in the CD uh, because um, he wanted a particular voice for that music." And um, one day he remembered me, he called me and invited me to, to sing with him. And I said, of course, <laughs> <laughs> you're taking too long to ask me that. <laughs> and we did it and it's beautiful. So you're starting off like the new Filippa, you're introducing the new Filippa to the country. What can we expect next from you? Uh, everything, <laughs> because I think this one day and the other day I just think and... Are you writing? Are you producing? What uh, are you doing currently? Uh, currently I'm writing mm -hmm. uh, about uh, my past, so okay. people I'll, can mm -hmm. can wait for that, because yeah. I, I will talk about my... my my relationships. <laughs> so <laughs> we're finished this off with the best thing we could do it. It's with Filippo's voice. I would ask you to sing a bit of your Eurovision song for our followers right now, like 15 seconds of it, just a little bit for them to be impressed. Versus <laughs> por arrimar poemas que nunca inventei Quem nos pôs assim a vida escala Quem te me levou roubou e a alma Mas de ti não sabe nada You're a vision news with attitude, we are at Setúbal and this is Filippa Azevedo. Stay tuned, put a like on the videos and all our social media. Don't forget, stay tuned. Bye!